guys. Today I'm going to be decorating my faith journal or my scripture writing journal, whatever you want to call it. And I'm going to start with showing you what last week turned out like. And here in this time, the robe's not coming off. It's 42 degrees outside. And it's not cold in here, but it's not super warm and which i like the temperature it is in here but um, because you can be snugly cuddly warm and things like this but i'm right beside this sliding glass door and it is better than the old one i can already tell you that with the difference because it's got the something in it i don't remember what it's called but anyways it's supposed to keep temperature better or whatever regulated insulation whatever I don't know anyway it's double paned or whatever but um being beside a window at any time you're still cooler so I'm leaving my big fluffy on so here we go <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying anymore but this is how it turned out and I had used a book that's a um Agenda 52. So I'm going to move this out of the way because I need it out of the way because I'm not using it anymore for right now. I'm going to grab the pages that I need and all the other things that I need as well. I will have to pull the sleeves up just a touch. And I'm going to go ahead and put in my October sticker so I can put in the week and this is for the week of October 24th through the 30th. So the month is almost over. Don't know what happened to it. Somebody stole it. I don't know. And at the top, I always put a grateful thought. These are some stickers I made from the Cricut Design Space. And they're just grateful for. And it's what it says because I put a grateful thought here at the end of the week. And, um... That's just the Cricut uh, logo. It was part of their thing that they had. So I thought it was cute. So I used it. And now I'm going to put in some whole reinforcement labels. I don't know why they're called labels. I thought labels always labeled something. I thought I always needed a word or something like that on it. Something that said, I don't know, planner <laughs> or pen <laughs> or, well, you can't really see the pen very well, but, or something. I don't know. It doesn't matter, though. As long as they work, they function, they do their job, that's what I care about. I only put them on one side because these not only are the vinyl, they're, they're pretty strong, but they're like the vinyl type. I don't feel like I need more than just one on each side. That piece is determined. It's going to stay right there. I got these from Amazon. Get out of my way. <laughs> Amazon. And there's 2,000 in the pack. So I'm set for a while. I don't have to buy any for quite a while. And I've been using these, I don't know, a couple few months already. I don't know how long I've been using them. I could look back at my Amazon purchases and figure out when I ordered them. But I did use my colorful ones a couple of times. And I did finish off my old ones before I started these. So that really wouldn't be the best idea. Because, I mean, it could tell me a roundabout. But I ordered them before I knew I was going to run out. You know, I knew it was running out. So I'm like... Yeah, got to get these. And they were a really good price, so I got them. And that's how it worked. So I don't think I'm going to need my pen again. I don't know why I still have it sitting here open. So let me move that out of the way. I like to get anything that I'm not using out of my way. That way I can have what I need 
right in front of me. You guys know I'm going to use this again. I use it just about all the time. Uh, and this one I use it almost every time. I think I'm going to use some of the gold foiled ones. Um, I don't know if I want to use... Why have I used two pages? I've started on two pages. Yeah, I'm going to use the gold foiled ones. Because... Um, I just think it'll be pretty. I'm going to show you the sticker book that I'm going to be using in a moment. But I just want to get some of this functional stuff down. And then I'll go to the decoration stuff. So this is Monday. And I'm going to do the days first. That's not centered. But that's okay. I'll try to do better on this page. And we're in the book of Psalms. And honestly... I should have had, oh boy, yes I should have, shouldn't I? I should have had the new scripture writing plan ready for you guys, but I don't. I don't have it ready. So, I will have it ready on the 30th. It will be ready. Because that's the next time I do one of these. It will be ready before the end of the month. And... You can check the community tab periodically. I may go ahead and do it tomorrow and have it ready for you guys so that you can go ahead and print it out. Uh, or I may have it even before this video comes out. So keep a check on that just in case there's ever anything that you guys need to know that I think you need to know anyway. That's about me, you know? I mean, you don't always have to know everything about what that I'm saying but if you're interested in something like that that'd be a good place to check it because I do post it there as well as one of the videos I posted in um, so I do post it there I post it on my Instagram so yeah it'll be ready for you soon though I may have it ready before this video ever goes out and if it if I do I will put a little thing in the description box so that you know oh I better put days I meant dates numbers I gotta put some numbers <laughs> it'd be a great idea we might want numbers oh look gold ones perfect I guess it's perfect. I don't know. It's close enough for me. I'm happy with it. I'm happy with this book. I really wish that I had always had one of these books. Because there were times whenever I didn't have date numbers and date covers and stuff like that. I had to go search for them. And having it like this just makes it so much easier. I don't have to search. Um, they're just already there for me. I guess I did something crazy and I took all three of them off at once. Why? I don't know. Because I did something crazy. But it worked out so far. Yep, yeah, that worked. Alright, so now I'm going to put down the functional part and then I'm going to show you the pretty part all of it's pretty I mean I don't think this is ugly I shouldn't have said the pretty part like that because it sounds like I'm saying that this is ugly but then again I second guess myself all the time I say things like that these are pretty um, these are the scriptures Psalm 31 18 and we are in the book of Psalms we will be in the book of Psalms for November as well Psalm 31, 19. Did I say 18 was the first one? Yeah, okay. Where did I put it even? Hello, where am I at? I don't know. I'm loose to my mind. 31, 20. We're in Psalm 31 right now anyway. Because I just, I, I just wanted to write the whole thing. 
3122 3123 3124 So, how many of these stickers do I have left? 1 2 3 4 5 6 oh, I don't have enough for next week. Oh boy. Okay, I'll figure out something. I think I have some more somewhere, but they're not the same colors. They're not the same color scheme. That's okay though. This is the book I'm using. It's the Bible Study Stickers from Daily Grace Co. Um, I have it marked here because it repeats and it starts repeating there. This page is the same as this. And I think it does it three times. I want to say it's, there's, all right, there's two. Yeah, three times. So if you buy one of these books from Daily Grace Co., just know that it's going to be the same stickers three times. Just to let you know. Okay, now, I didn't think. I don't even know if there's any gold in this at all. I honestly don't think there is. Can you stay open? Can you help me? I do not normally bend books like that. I actually cannot stand it when people do that to like a book that they're reading. But something like this, I don't know what else to do, honestly. So, I'm going to do this one. It says Strength for Today, Bright Hope for Tomorrow. And I think I'll put it over here in the corner. Um, I'm going to use this one. It says, He First Loved Us. Ooh, I ripped it a little bit. Oh, because it's not cut properly. That's why I ripped it. Come on. It'll be okay. You won't be able to tell once I get it down. And, um, like I said, I put a grateful thought here. It's just something I'm grateful for throughout the week. It doesn't have to be a big thing. It may not be big to someone else, but it could be huge to me. Just like your gratefulness, maybe something that's not huge to anyone else, but it could be enormous to you. A little cactus, no, it's not the right time of year, I guess, for this kind of stuff. But honestly, I don't, I don't concern myself with that stuff. I, I just don't care if I don't stick with trends as to why are they ripping. I don't remember this happening before with the other. Whenever I used this book before, I want to try to put that around that hole so that it doesn't get in the hole. There we go. Okay, I'm going to do another cactus. Oh, it's not cut either. Why? I think I'll put it over here. And... This one says Grow in Grace. I'm going to end up using this whole page. I just I hurt my finger with my... I'm going to go ahead and pull this out. If I would have known I was going to be using the whole page, I would have done that before. Okay. Alright. So flip it. Put these flowers on the bottom. That one didn't do crazy on me. There we go. That's kind of cute. And then I'm going to put these cactus, or this cacti. One is cacti. I learned that years ago. I don't remember who told me, but it, I remember learning it. I'm going to put this one over here. And I guess the only gold I have is what I put on there. Don't know why I decided to put gold, but whatever. It's fine. Um, I do want to put something else on, I maybe put something else there if I had like a flower or something, some small flower. Eh, not that. Yeah, I don't have anything else, so I'm not going to worry about that. I will put something else on the grateful part. Um, I don't know this one it says pray 
that's what we need to do. And and I know that that's like a reminder to pray or whatever, but I'm going to use this. It says faithful. And that's all I'm going to really do. I should have put this over here. That way the large one can be there and that one can be there. And now I don't know where to put this, but I want to put it down. I'm just going to put it here. Be a reminder to pray. I wanted something else on that page anyway. And that's all I'm going to do because this is used for script writing plan. I don't want to take up too much space. I don't want it to be to where that I can't write and I have to jumble things up or I have to get out post-its like I've had to do before. Yeah, I want it to be simple. And um, next week I will be putting one of the scriptures on this side. I'll do something with this, you'll see it. And then I'm going to be using this side and November and December will be in this back part. I will have to get some more paper out, but that's fine. I have thought about breaking it into three days, but that still wouldn't be enough. Um, but yeah, let's look at this. I'm glad I did use that little bit of foil because it gave it a little something prettier, a little extra, a little something, I don't know, a little shiny. So, this is what the Grateful Thought of the Week and Monday is going to be like. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, and Sunday. It's just simple, it's cute, and it's ready for me to go on Monday, whenever the time comes. So thank you for hanging out with me today. I do hope you enjoyed this. If you did, go ahead and do all the YouTube things. If you didn't, do them anyway because you might want to watch something else that I do. I don't only do planner videos. I also do daily vlogs, cleaning, cooking, just whatever's going on. I do, I'm, I don't want to call it motivational chats, but I like to talk a lot and I like to tell you things that help me. And sometimes whenever I have something that I need to talk about, I talk about it with you guys and it helps me work through situations, to work through things in my mind. It's just like having a friend sitting there with me, even though I know you guys won't see the video until the next day on those videos, I know that pretty soon you guys will be there with answers, with thoughts, with your own stories. And it just helps me to do things. It helps me to work things out in my mind and helps me to know that I'm not always alone and it also, I hope, helps you to know that you're not alone because first of all, we're definitely not alone. We have God, but He put humans here to help us through the things too. So, we just have to reach out whenever we need to and if you do need to reach out and you would like to do um, send me a prayer request because I do write prayer requests down and I do pray for you guys. If you would like to, you can, if you want it to be public, you can put it in the comment section. If you would like it to be private, you can send me an email or my Instagram. You can send me a direct message, um, because it's the same as it is here at Mom Cat's home. So, yeah, if you want to do script writing plan, I have one every month. I do not charge for it, and I never plan to. So, that is all I have for today. I do hope you really did enjoy this. What I would really like for you to do is leave me a comment down below telling me how you're doing. And remember, don't take any wooden nickels and be sweet. <laughs>